Doing, we're doing a deep dive on the Kazuya case cryptography system. In this particular um, time, you should be able to be able to do the system, know the names of the system, and know the translation of the, of the, the terms in Japanese. What are the steps of the Kazuya case cryptography system? Say them with me. What does Kazuri mean? Kesa. Kitami. Mune. 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 Ushiro. Tate Shio. Four points, or four point vertical, okay? What does Gitami mean? Hold. Hold. Juju Gitami is arm entanglement or arm what? Hold. Good. Absolutely fantastic. So, in the, in the Kazuri case Katami system, in the Kazuri case Katami system, the first, the first step of the Kazuri case Katami system is the Kazuri case Katami pin. What is the zero in the system? Is it? Which one is it? Uh, Ogoshi. Ogoshi is the zero in the system. Is Ogoshi correct? Because Ogoshi leads us into the system. All right. Now, when we get to Kazuri Case Katami, what are the what, what are the key points of Kazuri Case Katami? The number one key point is what? Pressure. pressure. What type of pressure? Third point pressure. What is third point pressure? Jackson. What is third point pressure? Thank you, sir. What is third point pressure? Excuse me. Pressure on the body. That's it. That. Thank you, sir. That's a decent answer. Third point pressure is, since it's Matthew. Uh, pressure. Concentrated pressure at the third point, two points being on the mat, third point being on the person. But third point what? Pressure. pressure. If I'm putting pressure on this dummy right now, is this third point pressure? No, is this third point pressure? No, Why? How many points are on the ground? How many? One, two, three, four, correct? Now, is that third point pressure? Yes. yes. Now, the third point pressure puts more pressure on the what? Body. On the body, on the person, on the individual, yes? yes so, how do we, what is the check that we utilize when we're training for third point pressure in here? What's the check we use? We use the alphabet test, correct. When you're going with a person, you use the alphabet test. If the person can say the alphabet without straining at all, you don't have good enough third point what? Pressure. You don't have good enough third, third, third point pressure. So let me utilize Logan and Carter, please. Come out in the middle. Logan, you're going to start saying the alphabet. Carter's going to work on his third point pressure. Begin the alphabet song, Logan, loud. Good. Now, when he starts struggling, we found the sweet what? Found the sweet spot. Thank you, Sensei John, for fixing yourself and not sitting like that in here. I love you. I think you're fantastic. You don't even have to pull your. You could do. You could. You could sit like we sit when we're older. Just spread your legs out, man. Yeah, you don't have to. You don't have to sit like that. The kids do, but spread your legs out, man, and just relax yourself. There you go. That's there you go. That's that's the old Sensei. It's the old Sensei sit. That'll work right there, buddy. Exactly. <laughs> well, you, when you were sitting with your legs crossed, you got the same look that I have when I'm trying to put, put my shoe on without the shoe horn. <laughs> I did that. at 48 I had to find I gotta find the shoe horn. Like today I had to find the shoe horn before I put my shoe on today. I can no longer stick those two fingers back there and get it wiggling and going. Everything is everything doesn't work like it used to, unfortunately. Praise the Lord. All right. Absolutely fantastic with the with the alphabet test. So the Kazuri Case Katami system, we have the alphabet test. Now, the most important part of the Kazuri Case Katami system is to maintain the what? Third point pressure. The second part is to control the upper what? The upper quadrant, the upper quadrant, if I take, if I take the body, all right, if I take the person's body, so I don't want to say Nick, if I take the body, all right, and you've seen me draw a horrible picture of the body before, draw a head, arms, legs, boom, all right, and I, and I cut the person, I cut the person in force, all right, my job is to control this upper what? That upper quadrant. The upper quadrant. Now. Sensei Matthew, please. No. Put your head facing this way, sir. On this upper quadrant, all right. 
The key of control of the upper quadrant is one, to maintain good quality pressure, third point pressure, which I'm not going to do right now because I'm talking and I want him to, to be able to exist. The second is I'm trying to get my, my leg as much as possible under this shoulder as I can. Because Mr. Matthew, Sensei Matthew needs to win this space by shrimping and getting his elbow in this space. Once his elbow is framed at this hip, he can now start to go shrimp yourself out and then recover. And he can recover. Come back. In order to control this upper quadrant space, all right, we're going to use the same thing that we use in the catch sequence. In the catch sequence, we go for the sleeve. They pull the sleeve back. Our hand goes to the what? Lapel. In order for him to recover like that, he needs to be able to get his elbow in and his head needs to be able to turn. So when we're here, when he gets his elbow in, I immediately jam my thumb into the collar, grab the collar, and I turn my hand this way to, to make his head what? Move. And I pull up and I make his head move. Once his head moves, I bring my knee to the ear, other knee to the hip, then my leg, my right knee slides down the body. Boom, and I pull the, the hand back up and I move myself back in the Muni Gatami. Understood? We went over this yesterday, yes? Second portion. The second portion is, let's say I, I'm trying to maintain Kajiri Case Katami. He gets his elbow in. Now he doesn't let me get my hand to the neck because he frames at the what? Frames at the elbow. I mean, at the, at the, um, at the bicep. So he moves his elbow in. I go to get the, man, this is bad news here. This is bad news because he's almost out when this happens. Now, this is what we call the circle of life. Okay? If this is broken. This is the circle of unalive. You can't say death anymore online when you write. You got to say unalive. So TikTok and Instagram don't get you. All right? It's a circle of death. He needs to form that circle. Same as in half guard. Form that circle, elbow in. Form that circle. Now it's hard. It's hard to get in this space. Now, if 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 since then Matthew wants to get out, his he can continue to come this way, bring your knee in and recover. Go back. Or this hand, the left hand moves where the right hand is. I'm sorry. Your right hand moves where your left hand is. Your your left elbow goes to the ground and you push in. Come up, push in, and then he gets on top of me. In order to stop this, all right, there's a movement that I do where I wrap the arms. Now, the movement before wrapping the arms, we're not going to put on video, all right? We did this yesterday, correct? When we wrap the arms. They come here, and we wrap the arms, and then we move ourselves to what? Muni Gatami. We come here, we wrap the arms, and move ourselves to Muni Gatami. Boom. We get here, I wrap the arms, I windshield wipe of the leg, step over the head, come back, knee up, and I finish what? Arm bar. He can also, winch, he can also answer the telephone, as soon as he answers the telephone, I move myself, grab the belt, straighten, move out, move myself in the Omoplata system, come up, tap. So, here's what I want to cover. Thank you, Sensei Matthew. Thank you. Here's what I want to cover. The Kazuri Case Katami system must be solidified in order for the rest of the system to work, which means the battle is at number one. And there's three, there's three most important things when it comes to Nawaza, when it comes to grappling, when it comes to any when it comes to any grappling art. Hell, when it comes to football, when it comes to basketball, any sport. What are those three main things? Position, position, position. Position, position, position. If you are out of position, nothing's gonna work. You can work as hard as you want to at 8:15 in your house. If you're supposed to be at work at 8 o'clock, you're out of what? Out of a job. Okay, that's what <laughs> It's gonna happen. Yeah, real position. You're out of position. You're out of position. You need to be in position in order to make things happen. So instead of trying to hustle yourself to the to the to the submission, you need to focus on maintaining each what? Position. Each step. The upper quadrant battle, the third point pressure. If you do the check, if you do a check, you could you could do the ABC test when you're rolling by li listening to his what? His what? His breathing. So if the breathing, if the breathing is not labored, it's not right. If the upper quadrant isn't controlled, it's not right. Don't what? 
Don't go to the next what? Do not go to the next step. Once I move to Munigatami, from the Munigatami option, I, on, I, I can leave Munigatami and head out to the MST, which is the mousetrap what? System. I can also, which is also called the Udigarami system. I can also leave Munigatami and go to the north-south system. The Kamishio Katami system. Kamishio Katami. Katate Jame. Kamishio Katami. Katate. I can leave Munigatami and go from there. I can leave Ushiro Keskatami and also move to the north south system if I want to. From Ushiro Keskatami. Sliding the arm back to the head, coming back. I can I can do all that. I can I can stay at Tate Shilgatami. I can move myself to many systems. Many of them. To the kat to the katat um the kata juji jame. Um, Nami Juju Jame, and then what? I can't do Gyaku. Doesn't work as well. It doesn't. But then there's an arm bar system we can use. We can do everything from there. We can also cut ourselves to the side, go to the neon belly what? System. The neon belly has a whole system. They push your knee this way. They push your knee that way. They push it at the chest. They push it down. Once you staple down each position, the submission will open up. I, all of you all trying to rush to get here to Juju Katami. No. What? This isn't over. This is position is greater than submission. Now, if I wrote it the other way, it would be different. Position is greater than what? Submission. If the position is right, the submission will take care of it what? Of itself. Okay? Now, some of us have been doing the, the Udigarami system, which they... We have Udigarami one way, which they call the Kabura and Jiu-Jitsu. Then we have Udigarami the other way, which they call the Americana. And then we have Udigatami, which they call the straight arm lock. It's Udigarami, Udigatami, Udigarami, Udigarami, Udigarami. This is called a what in here, a what type of cycle? What do we call this? We call this a washing machine cycle in here. Now, every, this has a washing machine cycle and uh, Radi and Sensei Matthew. Kazuri Case Katami. Kazuri Case Katami also has a washing machine cycle at the upper quadrant. Show me the drill for the washing machine cycle, right? The elbow comes in, boom, pulls up, boom. Get it back, pull up, elbow comes in, boom. Don't do that move, don't do it. Don't do it on camera, all right? Move this, just move the arm, there you go. Boom, exactly. No, no, go back and then go back. Go back, then go back to Kazuri Kizkadami. Correct, boom. And he can put her in that washing machine cycle over and over and over again until she wears down and she gets clean. And once it's clean, all right, then we can move to the what? Next thing. Then we can move her to Munich at time. And let me tell you what happens. You start getting frustrated when you can't get out. I don't care how old you are. You start turning into a five, six-year-old. Went to, hey, let me go. Let me get out. Let me get You can't get out. You can't get out. When you can't get out, you begin to do what? You begin to panic. And when you begin to panic, your breathing gets what? It gets labored and it gets, or it gets erratic. It's labor and gets erratic. And then when the breathing gets erratic and you're making all those movements, you become oxygen what? Depleted or deprived. And then you're in an oxygen relapse. And then the muscles aren't getting the oxygen that they need. And then the body begins to do what? Because the panic. You go from a psychological panic to a physiological panic. And you can feel it when it happens to the person. And when that happens, this is where you need to hold on very tight because you're going to get what we call the dead man what? Kick. You get that last dead man kick. That, that last... Ah! 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 <laughs> <laughs> <All right. laughs> you, you understand what I'm saying? That that's how we work the progression. But you've seen me roll like this. I had to go over this with um somebody in the morning class. You've rolled with me a lot, okay? Mitch has said this. How many submissions have I done to Mitch? None. I've done submissions to you because sometimes it's been only you and I. But most of the time, I'm submitting you with what? Pressure. Pressure. Most of the time, I'm submitting you. Have I done a submission to you? No, never. I've never done a submission to you. No, Have I done a submission to you before? Never. I've never done a submission to you. I am a judoka. I, I, I like the newaza. I love the newaza. I, I don't, I'm at the point now where I'm no longer calling Brazilian Jiu-Jitsu Brazilian Jiu-Jitsu because I've studied long enough. It is solely and completely newaza. That is all it is. They are, People who do jujitsu are just people who specialize in newaza. They are newaza specialists, just like there's some people who do judo who are tachiwaza specialists. There's some people who do judo who are kata specialists. There's some people who do judo who are 
arm bar specialists. Some people do judo who are, are striking, a Timmy Wiser specialist, what, whatever that. Those people do judo. I do judo. I am, I am very proficient in Newaza, more so than I am in Tachiwaza. That's it. That's all it is. I understand what a lot of jujitsu instructors don't understand because they're so, they're so busy hunting for the submission, these new wave, new age people, that they don't understand Osakomi Waza. Your Osakomi Waza should be so good that you should be able to submit people with pins. And if you cannot submit people with pins, or you hear people saying, oh, a pin won't end the fight, or you can't submit people, you've heard this before. You've heard jujitsu people say this before. It's because they haven't gone with any good judo people. Because I'm telling you, I've traveled the world since they met. If you travel the world, if you travel long enough, and somebody submit you with a pin, absolutely. And if you and if your osakomi waza is not to the point where you can submit the person, and your osakomi waza is not good yet. Period. Your uki katami, your case katami, your kazuri case katami, you should be able to submit people. Case in point, you watch Josh Barnett submit Dean Lister, the boogeyman who gets out of everything, with what? A case of Gatami pen. Not because you're a case of Gatami, but a basic case of Gatami pen. If your Osakomi Waza is good, you should be able to, to, to end people with the, uh, with, with the fight. I want to do a deep dive on this today. There's a video that's similar to this from the morning class that is on Instagram. It's also on YouTube that you can watch this whole, it's a 21 minute video on a deep dive of Kazuri Case Katami without the part that we're not putting on film in here because that's, well, you guys pay me for that, all right? Those people don't pay me for that. I appreciate it, but if you'd like to get any products, they're available at www.newazaexcellence.com. We have the best push and play products available online just for you. Absolutely fantastic. I'll show you the part that's missing.